one killed and 14 injured after a tragic explosion. The GCPD is opening an investigation into what they are calling an industrial accident. Wayne Enterprises Chief Technology Officer Lucius Fox died last Tuesday in the violent blast. A small service is being held for the tech giant and father of three at Divinity Church this Sunday. Oh, God. <laughs> Should have told me. Mm. You don't have to worry, Lucius. Tiffany. I'm gonna take care of your family. Mm, that's I will. As if they were my own. Just like Lucius took care of you. Mm-hmm. Lucius helped raise you, Bruce. It was family. Riddler's attack on the casino was one thing. But this bastard. This is personal. <laughs> the bat computer upgraded to Windows 10. You didn't allow Windows Store updates, so, so it bat screened. <laughs> tore a family apart in the process. Don't worry, Al. I will find him and bring him to justice. I have a particular set she of skills. I will find you, and I will kill you. I'm glad to see your sense of duty still But yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much yeah. Of course. It won't bring poor Lucius back. I can't imagine how devastated she must be to lose her father in such a violent way. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. I should go talk to her. Yes. She can use all the support she can get. Hmm. Be nice or just go, hey, join us! Hey, <laughs> Tiffany. I still can't believe he's gone. None of this. None of this feels real. No, it won't. Um. <sighs> Tiffany, I... I know what you're going through. I remember what it was like when I lost my parents. Mm hmm <laughs> That, uh... Sudden emptiness. There's no feeling like it in the world. I don't think it'll ever go away. It certainly didn't for me. Mm -hmm. He loved working for you, you know? They hardly saw him at home because of it. Mom used to complain my little brother was growing up without a dad. Mm. We're at a tender moment now, guys. Now I guess it's true. He was so busy. I can't remember the last time I got to hang out with him. Just father and daughter. Just thought there'd be more time. There were so many things I wanted to talk to him about. So much wisdom mm, uh, at the head of his. I know it's no consolation, but the work your father was doing, it was important. More important than Emily. That's not what I meant. Well, what did you mean? Oh, here we go, getting angry. <sighs> Tiffany. I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't blame you. <laughs> uh, no, maybe that wasn't okay. the right thing okay. to say. It's okay. Just let it out. I'm just... <laughs> trying to wrap my head around it all. <laughs> I saw his remains, Bruce. <laughs> there, there was hardly anything left. Oh, shit. He was fucking obliterated. Shit. What were you guys working on that could have caused that? It, it doesn't quite add up. Please tell me. Tiffany, I will tell you soon. Just not here. What do you mean? Why not? It's not the right time. Why, Bruce? What are you mixed up in? <sighs> Fine. Just tell me one thing. That weird disc. Was that what killed him? 
Did you put my father's life at risk for that? I'm begging you. Just tell me that one thing. Nah. I thought it was safe, Tiffany. I, I really did. I had no idea Lucius could get hurt. Please forgive me. Forgive you? Uh oh. I hope you can forgive yourself. D d um. Whatever you got my father into, I will find out. And I will shout it to the world. Um. Ooh, no. Um. Yeah, I think I may have fucked up here. I don't know. So sorry, really. It's such a shame. At least he went out with a bang, right? Oh no. For that, we can all be grateful. You, you knew my father. Well, no, but judging um, by all um, the lovely people here, he must have been quite a man. Either that. Hey, hey, how about giving Tiffany some space? Huh? Bruce, <laughs> buddy, no. it's good to see you. Now she is a baddie, Bruce Smash. <laughs> well, I hope not. I'm gonna iron this out. Absolutely right. Enjoy the rest of your day. Uh. Look, I know it's a closed casket, but uh, I can see by the jeans. Uh, your friend was a looker, huh? Why are you here, John? I told you I'd see you again, didn't I? You and me, we're two threads in the same stitch. Mm. Look, I, I, I got you a little something just, just to mark the occasion. What? What? Nah. <laughs> Childish scribbles. I knew you'd be hurting, see? I thought it might make you feel better. You think this is funny? My friend is dead. Oh, I got it wrong, didn't I? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Gotta be quiet as church mice, right? Oh dear, this is going really, really well. It hasn't, um, it hasn't been easy for me out here, you know? I'm the new guy now. It's the freedom that gets to you. There's so damn much you hardly know what to do with it. <laughs> it's not like Arkham. I'm, I'm, I'm actually starting to feel bad for him now. It's those padded walls. Where the lines were drawn. Which ones not to cross? How did you get out? Oh my god, did you escape? <laughs> Didn't have to. Dr. Leland signed the papers herself. Mm. She always had a soft spot for me. If everyone could please take their seats, uh, we will begin. Would you just sit down? <sighs> Today we this is, to honor this the is bad. Of Lucius Fox. He was a friend, a father, a husband, a leader. You are crashing my friend's funeral, John. You better have a good reason. Oh, I do. I need that uh, favor you owe me. You know, you might have been a little reluctant at the time, but if it wasn't for me, you'd still be in Arkham. Sleeping off your meds in the rec room with Zaz. You're, you're gonna do right by me. Oh no, what do you need me to do? I know, you're a man of your word. I didn't agree to that. But you did help me out. Friends look out for each other. Am I right? And now, he's gone. A vital link in our You see, I met some inspiring people out here, made some new friends. Made a kind of pact. Mm. They're amazing, Bruce. That special breed who live by their own rules. They remind me of you. Of your father. So who mm. are they? You'll find out when you meet them. They're looking to bring someone like you into the Oh, no. I, you, you will meet them for me, won't you? 
please. I, I've got a lot oh. of writing on this. I already told them you would. Please. Give him the favor. He's a goody. At least, you know. Uh, I'd be happy to chat with your friends. Yeah, let's just do that. Yeah, I will, you know, I will meet with them, but, you know, this doesn't seem good. I'm not so at all. I could say that. We are going to have so much fun. Uh. I knew this would work out. This air between us, this is real. You can't force this kind of friendship. I want to commemorate the moment. No! The guys will be so excited. Now, what filter should I use? Put that away. This is a funeral, for God's sake. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I got so caught up in it all, I completely forgot. Yeah, that's right. Put it down. Put it down. I just know you're going to hit it off with the guys. I should warn you, though. I've got an enemy. Real famous Batman. <laughs> Calls himself the Riddler. How do you know the Riddler? Know him? I want to rip his eyeballs out. Oh. He's a thief and a killer, and worst of all, he's he's rude. I tried to let the yep. authorities know the kind of low. Ah, Wabbit, thank you very much for the uh, you know subscription there, buddy. Thank you. You know him too. Of course, a man. Wayne's caliber knows everyone. I shouldn't be surprised. Mm. Not your uh, Just play it cool. Or so I thought. Uh, just from the news, the guy's clearly a murderer, sick in the head. Don't know the half of it. If I had my way, that smarmy know-it-all would never leave his hole. You mean his hole? You know where he is? No, no, not exactly. Oh. No. Maybe I said too much. Uh. I already said I'd meet your friends, John. Now tell me what you know. Jeez. <laughs> well, it's not oh, much to no. You. Yeah, I, I really don't know much. I heard the egomaniac always made people go to him for meetings. Somewhere in the East End. Where in the East End? Honestly, that's all I know. And even that might be out of date. If you're so eager to find him, why don't you let me help you? Oh, I'll God, no. And get back to you. No. See if I can't find out where that jerk puts his head down. It'd be just like oh, the old fuck days. It. I would appreciate that, John. That's what friends are for, Bruce. Just meet mine later. Like I ask. Look, I think I outstayed my welcome here. I'm, I'm just gonna slip away. Excuse me. Sorry. <clears throat> it's, uh. It's been so nice catching up, Bruce. I miss this. This trust between us. But that was. Oh my god. Do I trust him or do I track him? Fuck it. Me too, John. Be in touch. Goodbye, Bruce. Until next time. Intriguing fellow. Certainly not one for decorum. No. She's not happy with me. I don't think that outburst went unnoticed. Well, whatever you say about John, he gave me a lead on Riddler's location. Inform Gordon. Tell him to drag up GCPD records on Gotham's East End. And tell him we're on Riddler's trail. Well, this is not how I'd want to end things here. No. This just does not seem to be going well. But then again, this is Gotham, so... Marlborough! Enjoying the view. Yeah, hard to do these days. There's one thing for the bad parts of town to get uglier. But when places like Wayne Towers start falling apart, makes you wonder what's next. Yeah, I bet Bruce Wayne is wondering the mm -hmm. same thing. Seems like the world's got it out for that guy. Spends some time in Arkham, gets drugged through the dirt by the media for something he didn't do. Finally picks yeah, himself up. What happens? Someone bombs his company. 
Wayne's still in one piece. It's the dead who deserve your sympathy. They have it. Them and their families. Mm-hmm. You said you had a lead on Riddler. Hiding somewhere in the East End. Why am I not surprised? East End's been a no man's land since Harvey Dent blew it up. <laughs> I've tried to get more patrols out there, but City Hall's not giving up the fight. Yeah, fires. usual problems. The area between 42nd and 48th, more or less lawless. That narrows down the search at least. Hmm. Ooh. Let's see what we got here. 43rd. Looks like gang activity's heating up along 43rd. Uh, I'll see what I can do. Hey, I get it, but we're stretched thin, I told you. Yeah, Riddler's a loner. I bet he's avoiding that area. More than likely. <clears throat> the land at the end of 44th was recently purchased anonymously. Well, the only thing there is an old water tower. Hmm. Something feels fishy mm -hmm. about that. My gut tells me that's the place. Agreed. Uh, nice work, Batman. Didn't even check the other place. If just leave pans out, Waller will have to eat her words. <laughs> Whatever you said to her at the casino really got up her nose. No, I didn't. Yeah, I just left. I have to tell you, I got a bad feeling about her. How so? The way she goes after criminals. She's ruthless. <laughs> Not the way to do it. Puts her people at risk. And believe me, she doesn't let due process get in her way. So stop at nothing. And I mean nothing to get her man. It doesn't sit right with me. And I don't think she's good for Gotham. As far as law enforcement goes, Jim, you were the best of it. I don't know many cops with as much heart as you. Yeah. Uh, I appreciate your saying that. Waller, she doesn't see that as a strength. I was ordered to give her updates on breaks in the Riddler case. Uh, if there's a chance he's there, we should probably let her know. Don't want to give her ammunition with the governor. She's already got him breathing down my neck about what went down yeah. the casino. Notify Waller. She's proven useful so far. Just be careful around her. Yeah. She moved her people into my downtown precinct without so much as a please. Oh, fucking thing. hell. I tell you, Batman. She keeps on chipping away at my authority. I'm gonna crack. Then let's find Riddler before it comes to that. <laughs> Why have my people call her people on the way? Oh, we've got Riddler people for their so people. Clever after we come people, up. people for people. Yeah. So yeah, it's probably a good idea to inform her. Oh look, it's an ominous water tower. Caught up in briefings, can't get here for a while. She said she appreciates the cooperation. Not exactly cozy, is it? Let's see what we can learn. Right, time to be a detective. Let's start far left and work our ways right. Nothing. Bookshelf. Newspaper clippings. Yeah, that's obviously more concerning. But monkey statue? Let's look at the monkey statue. See no evil. Hear no evil. Speak no evil. Mm-hmm. Someone's keeping a scrapbook. Vain, isn't he? Uh-huh. You set up a trap. Where's your trap, said Batman? It's stuck. No way to open it from the inside. Then how do we get out? We go in. After you. Uh. Now that's just clever. Okay. 
Okay. Give me a good, honest crack house any day. So who are you, and why are you on the floor? Oh. God. It's in your pockets. Special Agent Mario Fernandez. Holy ah. crap. He's one of Waller's. So they already found it. They already knew. One shoe is missing. The sole of the other one's almost completely melted through. Hmm. He's missing parts of his fingers oh, and right that device. We saw this before. The victim in the casino. It's on the head. One of his pupils is fully dilated. The other's contracted. A clear sign of mm -hmm. brain trauma. Huh. Well, there's no sign of a blow to the head. No, that's because it was like sound or something. The man bit his tongue clean through. He must have suffered a shock or a sudden jolt. And then the ears. There's some hemorrhaging from the ears. His eardrums mm -hmm. must have burst. Uh, oh, hello. There's the phone. He was trying to call for help. The phone isn't getting a signal. Damn it. Me either. So, yeah. That's a hell of an invitation. Riddler's playing games. Mm -hmm. Bet he tried to play along. We can learn from his mistakes. Let's find out what he did wrong. You wanna leave? Get inside. Yeah, of course I do. So, shoe. There's the shoe. And it. One shoe. Melted. Must belong to poor Cinderella over there. But yay, we get to do some investigating with Gordon. Hmm. Unfinished chamber. Prototype of the trap he used on Mori. The armor, extremely sturdy. Ensuring there's no possible way to open them other than solving his riddles. This is an insane way to commit crimes, even for this city. <clears throat> He's clearly seen many, many Saw films. Metal mesh lining the walls. Riddler has converted this entire place into a giant Faraday cage. Faraday what? An enclosure designed to block electromagnetic fields. No signals in or out. Guess it explains why our phones aren't getting signals. Mm -hmm. Clever son of a bitch. Right, let's have a look. What's with the safes? Masks. Each one missing a different facial feature. Hmm. The senses. They're missing their senses. Like the monkey statues. You're right. There must be a connection. Uh, I see the open safe. There are bleeds inside. And a lot of blood. Huh. We know Riddler likes penalizing his victims for wrong mm -hmm. answers. Safes with electronic locks. <sighs> Shut up. Yep. These must be the goal of whatever game we're playing. So, where's the monkey statue? It's way up at the top, isn't it? <clears throat> yeah, it was way up at the top. Oh no. This desk. Body cam. Look at this. Well, that's the same kind of body cam the GCPD issues its officers. Maybe there's a clue on the recording. Can't hurt to look. Uh, so the Because you've been so candid with me, I'm giving you a chance your other comrades won't get it. A 
chance of getting out of this alive. We'll catch you. Mm. The agency, they'll I shouldn't have to remind you that you've been chasing me for years. <sighs> and I've always been two steps ahead. Yeah. If you win the game, I'll let you go free. And you'll get a consolation prize. An exclusive sneak peek into how I'm going to kill all of your colleagues. <laughs> now, how is that for motivation? Screw you! Oh. He had the agent bound while he beat him. <clears throat> so, what else is on the desk? Oh look, agency pistol. That's an agency issue pistol. That's a hell of a jolt. I saw it take down Riddler's goons at the casino. It was impressive. Gotta give it to Waller. Her people have great tech. Yeah, well, fuck Waller. More monkey statues. I'm starting to sense a theme here. That's all of them. Okay. So now let's have a look. Mm. Scratches on the monitor. The polarizing filter has been tampered with. Like in sunglasses. Monitors typically have a polarizing filter to reduce mm. reflection. I don't see anything. Impossible to see with the naked eye. We're going to have to look at it through a polarized lens. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Uh, well, let's have a look at the death chamber. Another one of Riddler's sick contraptions. Some kind of murder box, I guess. Well, he was always a wacko, but this takes it to a new level. Hmm, what's up the floor? It's still warm. There must be some kind of heating element underneath. This thing is built like an oven. Oh, yeah. You could be cooked alive in there. We all, oh, wait, hang on, there is a thing there. Won't budge. It must be locked in place. Turn me round, but not the right way, and you might live to see another day. What does it mean? Turn me round, but not the right way. So, the glass, it's polarized. So it is. Okay, so heated floor to go with the shoe. The floor of the box heated up while the agent was inside. He tried standing on one foot to save the other, causing that shoe to catch on fire. When he exited the box, he tried to put the fire out, but couldn't. So he threw off his shoe. Mm-hmm. So, linking that. So. Missing fingers, obviously. From here. The agent must have been looking for the answer at one of these safes. He chose the wrong one. Cost him his fingers. I got a hunch. Come here. No matter how careful Riddler is, chances are good he hasn't scrubbed his own computer. Good call. It's worth mm -hmm. checking out. <clears throat> ah, look. Look at this amazing operating system. Uh, Mori. He sold technology to Riddler. Uh -huh. Talk about strange bedfellows. You know, Waller's been keeping pretty tight tabs on Mari for a while now. She must have known. We're done. What does it say? Riddler's not working alone. Mm -hmm. Just wonderful. More psychos to worry about. He and his colleagues. They don't see eye to eye. Apparently, they don't like his beef. Yeah. Hey, 
Maybe we'll get lucky they'll kill each other. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe. I recognize some of the names on this list. They're all Waller's people. Names, addresses. I just realized this is all still episode one. I haven't even got to episode two yet. Get out of here. Okay, so he's doing that. And so, polarized monitors. Step away from the melted shoe. That is with that. If this door were closed, the portal would be looking right at those monitors. Since the monitors have been tampered with, it's likely there's a message on it. One that can only be seen with a polarized lens. You won't know until you're inside the box, though. Hmm. You got a VR in that cow or something? Something like that. <laughs> I've got all the pieces of Riddler's puzzle. Now I need to know what order they happened in. Hmm. So link the events in the correct order. So it started with the chair. Um. Riddler's message on the monitors. Maybe he went to the death chamber. The agent woke up here where his body cam fell off. Once he found he couldn't call for help, he saw the message on the monitors and willingly put himself inside the murder box. <clears throat> then the shoe. The agent's shoe caught fire inside the murder box, so he opened it in a panic. As soon as he was out of the box, he ripped off the burning shoe and threw it. Somewhere in the confusion, he must have missed something crucial. And then... From where he lost his shoe, the agent beelined for the wall of safes. He opened one, but chose poorly. The blade sliced off his fingers. But then how did he die? And there he met his end. Though it's still unclear how and when his eardrums... Yeah, there must have been some stopped. kind of sound. The agent made a number of mistakes. Mistakes we can avoid. The heat inside the box forced him to run out before he could... Before he could get Riddler's next clue. Poor bastard couldn't withstand the heat. The bat suit's armor is heat resistant. It'll buy me more time to find Riddler's next clue. Getting inside the box and starting the game is the only way we're getting out of here. This is insane. You know that, right? Yes. The last man who went in there is dead. There's a good chance it'll kill you too. <clears throat> Any mistake could be my last. I won't be able to do this without you, Joe. Wow. Well, yeah, like let's that. put the pressure on your shoulders. Let's win this game. I need you, Jim. Keep rising, Batman. Turn the wheel. Yeah, I need to do it the out of the way. Can almost make out a message. Come on. One won't see trouble and one tells no lies. Ask the third if he hides the prize. The monkeys. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face when mm. those senses removed. Yeah, I'll check. Ah, oh, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. Oh, here it is. What the hell? Congratulations! You're almost done. Mm. That is, if you can withstand my short range ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? Oh, shit. Oh. 
Oh. What was the riddle? Oh. What was it? What was it? What was the riddle? I've forgotten the riddle! After third of the price of One minute's in trouble. So, here no evil? Yes! Oh my god, that was annoying. Whatever's in that safe better be worth all this pain. A fucking missile. It's a home nah, well. missile. What is it home in on? Looking at its schematics now. A signal. A radio signal. Mm -hmm. A signal. That's that's how mm. we do well, it. Well, well, Wabbit, you died. definitely called it. That's how they'll all die. Riddler. Maury sold me missiles for all of my enemies. Everyone on my list gets one. Most won't even know what's coming. For a brief second, their dull existences will light up. <sighs> Why are you doing this, Riddler? Haven't you killed enough? I have a lot of enemies, Batman. While they're still breathing, I still have work mm. to do. I'm trying to get a handle on you, Batman. Partnering with Gordon is one thing. From what I remember of the old days, he's harmless enough. Yeah, we'll see about that when you're in cuffs. But the agency, they're a natural enemy to people like you and mm. me. You must be desperate if you're making friends with them. You must be really up against the ropes to want that government scum in your corner. They're no friends of mine. No, they're no. not. They'll smile to your face to get what they want. The agency uses people, Batman. Corrupts them, breaks their minds. I wasn't always like this. The agency made me. No, oh, this is garbage. Yeah, Waller's a hard ass, sure, but she had nothing to do with why he's so messed up. I didn't say Waller, did I? Mm. This goes way before her time. But I don't forget. That's the thing about having a mind like mine. Yeah, <laughs> you're still everything. Whatever happened to you, it doesn't let you off the hook. You're still responsible for all the pain you've caused. Indeed. You think I'm asking for mercy? I was running things in Gotham before you could walk. I just wanted to see if the man who claims he fights for justice is really as good as he believes. Mm. But then, you already answered that for me, didn't you? When you offloaded my puzzle on your friend. Why don't you tell Gordon here what happened to Lucius Fox? Watch out, Commissioner. For all his preaching, Batman knows when to sacrifice a pawn to win the game. It was a smart move. Getting out of the way of the blast. Uh... Something only a pragmatist would do. I would never give up an innocent life. Not even to save my own. <laughs> That's not what it looks like for me. Bastard. Gordon doesn't know what to make of any of it. Trust is hard-earned, yet easily lost. Isn't it, Commissioner? Oh, shit. Come on, now. Don't get your tights in a twist. I knew you weren't sharp enough to do it on purpose. There's no room at the top for schoolboys who are too squeamish to fight in the gutter. You don't have what it takes to be a player in this oh, town. Bastard. Not without giving up those values you hold so dear. Game on! What a bastard. <clears throat> what did... What did Inga, right? Inga? I'll wait for a while and pass on what we found. 
She won't be happy when she finds out Riddler knows about every agency. Mm, oh, what did, oh, what did he get right? I don't blame yeah, about the homing, they were my cops, the homing thing. You know, you definitely called that well early. Just keep your eyes open, Jim. In the meantime, I'll stay on Riddler's tail. Hey, hey, hold up a sec. What Riddler said in there about the agency, smoke and mirrors, you ask me. But the thing about Lucius Fox and the blast at Wayne Tower, you got to level with me. You got some connection with that Wayne Tech guy you didn't tell me about? Uh... Lucius Fox was an ally of mine. That got him killed. I got to say, the fact I had to learn about it from Riddler instead of you, it doesn't sit right with me at all. I thought we had some trust, you and I. What do you expect me to do with this? Mm. Am I just supposed to sit on my hands? Pretend I never heard uh. any of it? You are your own man, Jim. You'll come to your own decision. Uh, uh. I mean, I wasn't born yesterday. I know you probably have a network of civilians working for you. Oh. Yeah. I you can't do the kinds of yeah. things you do without a gigantic support system. You do. Yeah. I'm, I'm, you get some brownie points for that. But, uh, yeah, Wabbit, yeah, you do. I never heard what I heard in there. All right? Batman. I'm sorry for your loss. <clears throat> so, relationship has changed. How do I check these things? Does, pad button? No, I'll... No, wait till it loads. <clears throat> 